Hello everyone, this is Senor Computer Man and welcome to an unboxing video. The today's item, we had this video game capturing device made by AGP Tech. Um just got here. Uh the box pretty pretty good quality if I do say so myself. You have all the different kind of things you have here that you can connect it to and all that basic information really. Uh, throughout you have the logo, you have all the other stuff. I like how it says please do not record copyrighted material. It's pretty good. Uh, see a bunch of Chinese writing stuff. Alright, it just tells you basic things. So let's just open this bad boy up right here. Alright, alright, so right at the top, first thing we get is the device itself. Pretty small actually. I Definitely pictured it being bigger, like really, really, like a lot bigger. All right, let's just open this up and try to get this out. All right. So, what we have here? Um, uh, got USB, got an in, a mic, and an out, and a record button. It seems with a little LED to show us that it is recording. So that's a pretty nice feature. I like that. It's actually really lightweight. Like really lightweight. Like I like the material. Pretty nice. Pretty high quality. Over here we have the HDMI stuff for the more current generation stuff. I'm pretty sure this is for like the older stuff so we can record older things. That's a pretty good quality because you don't get that a lot with the newer things. So we have the in output input and um, I guess this is for like I don't even know what this is for. You guys should let me know in the comments. And then here we have power. On the top we just have the logo HD video capture. On the bottom, nothing really much. Just screws and you can see a little bit inside the component. This is probably where the fans are. Okay, so let's open the box up. Alright, okay. This is pretty smooth. Oh, okay. The whole thing just came out. Alright, um... Let's just open this bad boy up. You have to open it from the side for some reason. Alright, this is everything pouring out. Awesome. There's nothing else in there. So what we have here is a instructional video, I guess. Can't wait to look at that. Uh, we have the manual, of course. Ooh, they gave us little HDMIs, I think, here. Yeah, these are HDMI's. They gave us HDMI's to use as needed. So, thank you for that. Um, gave us a charger. This is a pretty big charger, but actually really lightweight. So, it's not that bad. It's kind of small by the seams, by the looks of it. But I don't think I'm going to be needing like a 50 foot long cable. So, that's perfectly fine. Uh, here we have little adapter cords things I guess to plug in the old school stuff oh here we go this is where that where this uh, little port goes right there for the sm for like the older stuff so that's actually really good that's very convenient um, I will be trying this out throughout the week I'm gonna test it out see how good the quality is how recording it is like how good the recording is um, see what it can do and I will evaluate it as the week progresses. I'm going to try to use it as much as possible, but I'm not sure how much I'm going to be recording console games, in all honesty. So yeah, I would like to say once again, uh, thank you to AGP Tech for providing me with this stuff. They did not sponsor this video, but they did provide me with this uh, game capturing device. So thank you once again for that. Um, yeah. So I will see you guys in the future. Alright guys, so it's been a little bit more than a week, sorry to say, but I got caught up with a whole bunch of other stuff and so you know how it is. Sorry for the delay, but this HD video capturing device. Now this, I was very proud of. I enjoyed it very much and I will tell you why. So this is very small, very lightweight, easy to carry around. You don't really need to carry a whole bunch of stuff, just the like the the charger that goes connected to this, 
Um, and maybe a microphone, if you do that, is not a lot. You can just easily throw it into a backpack, just carry it around maybe, and it's completely fine. So, all you need with this is a console, a USB, and a charger and all that. And a mic if you want to have like co um, current content. Uh, I didn't try out the mics, uh, sadly to say, but I'm pretty sure it would be pretty good. And if not, you could always just um, connect an external mic, which is just as good. But I was very happy with the recording. It does record at 1080p. You can also change it to 720. It does uh, save both. So you don't even need a computer to record. You just need a USB, and it'll save it automatically to that USB. And I was very happy with this. The recording came out very, very nice. Uh, you can see that right now. me if you can. smooth there was no frame rate drop in with that does happen with some recording devices and especially now that this is very affordable and you can record console gaming for a very nice price and very great quality the only thing that was a problem with it however was the light the LED that shows up there it says on the packaging or in the packaging that it'll light up blue and then pink when it's recording but that wasn't the case it was a green and a red color but it's not too bad as you can easily figure it out because it's very obvious when it's recording and when it's not but yeah that was the only problem so nothing really major just wrong colors for the light so nobody really cares but yeah and here you can see the, this is for like retro game gaming I'm pretty sure I didn't try that out because I don't have any retro gaming devices and the mic of like I said I didn't try it out and yeah it's easy to understand. You just put it like how it says, output, input, and this is, um, can't remember what that is. That's for something else. But yeah, and then your power, it's all simple, very easy. Just press the record button and off you go. You have wonderful quality for videos if you want to do that. So yeah, I definitely recommend this if you're on a budget and you want to record some console gaming because there are a lot of console games going out now and the good thing about this is that it records both PS3, PS4, Xbox One and Xbox 360 which you don't get a lot with a bunch of other uh, devices because they either record the last generation or the current generation now which is the PS4 and Xbox One so thankfully you have a variety so you don't have to spend hundreds of dollars updating your system and all that. So yeah, that's my final review. Thank you everyone for watching. And I'll see you another time.